Hi everyone, I am Susanti, doctoral nursing student, University of Indonesia. My title research, Anxiety Disorder Among Elementary Students. Anxiety is one of the most prevalent childhood mental health problems. Anxiety in elementary school children will affect social function, academic function, and mental well-being. The percent of anxiety in elementary school will increase the rise of mental health problems at the next stage of development. Data related to anxiety in elementary school children is needed so that intervention can be carried, carried as early as possible in children. The purpose of the research is to identify the anxiety disorder in students grade 4 and 5 at the elementary level. The method used is a quantitative method with a descriptive design. Research ethic was approved by IRB in West Java, and all participants were given written informed consent before collecting the data. A sample of 135 students from the private elementary school participated in this study. The instrument used a screen of child anxiety related disorder consisting of 41 questions. Reliability instrument was 0.81 and validity was 0.67. The result of the research, the elementary student age 10 to 11. The gender student 48.9% are boys and 51.1% are men. Frequency distribution of anxiety 40% general anxiety, 48.1% panic disorder, 28.9% Experience school confidence. 65.9% social anxiety and 40% separation anxiety. Discussion The study showed that of the 100 Seven respondents who experience anxiety disorder. There are more than half of respondents, as many as 55 respondents were female. Female students are entering their twin are experiencing significant physical change. This means they also need to complete the task of development as teenager. Children experience pressure due to well at school. This pressure to thrive was shown is have positive effect and negative effect. The negative effect like negative self-esteem, worry, and rumination can disturb children's psychological well-being. Contraction the most responding experiencing anxiety disorder and less than half of respondents experiencing a generalized anxiety disorder, a panic disorder, spirited anxiety disorder, and school avoidance. More than half of the respondents suffer from a social anxiety disorder. So, teacher, parents, and health workers was work to help elementary school students overcome their anxiety disorder. Thank you very much for your attention.